Hi guys, so this is my video for today and basically I'm going to talk about my experience with bullying. Well, I've been, I can firstly say I've been bullied most of my life throughout school, throughout secondary school, throughout college as well and sometimes in work and all like when um yeah and um calling me fat ugly um got greasy hair um the clothes i wear is for 30 year olds um i smell um that my life is just not worth living really and not many of you will know this, but a couple of years ago, I tried taking my life. And so I am not really, you know, I obviously it did work. But I think it really scared my parents and my family. So I was just like, well, I'm not going to do it again, <laughs> for sure. But, um, it's not nice. It's not a nice experience. And that's why I try to be nice to everyone and trust everyone that I meet. But when you when you get betrayed and you find it hard to trust anyone, even your old oldest friends, like you get you you fail to trust anyone you can, even your own family, really, because it gets that hard. Um, it's just like, well, I want to try and, I mean, I'm in a better place now. I mean, I, I was in a relationship for nine months. It was the happiest time of my life, other than when I found out my mum had got breast cancer. And we had some rocky times, but, you know, and then... Now he just sort of, he just blocked me on Facebook and I had to have counselling because I got so depressed and that my family were really, really worried about me. And I just sort of trapped all my feelings that I'd normally show. So it was like, because nobody would listen to me. So it's just like, well, it was a, it was a very difficult time. And, um, but now I've finished my finished my counselling and it's all good it's, it's all right for now and yes yeah, it's, it's not going too bad I mean you know I'm not doing this for my sympathy for any sympathy I'm just saying about my experience because I've seen a lot of youtubers do this so you know I mean yeah I'm a plus size girl you know what I mean like I know I am but I'm healthy I go to the gym, I walk, I, you know, I eat, try and he eat healthily. You know, I don't wear clothes that are for ages 30 and over. Like, I have the same taste as my mum, but my mum has a younger taste, if that makes sense. Like, she doesn't wear clothes at her because they look better because the younger ones look better on her because it makes it her look younger if you know what I mean so I have like similar taste to my mum and um that doesn't make me any older than what I am I mean <laughs> it's quite funny because someone because this guy said at work um I actually look younger than 21 but I don't honestly think I do and um, as you can see today, guys, I got makeup on. I haven't really got much makeup on, but I got a bit of blusher. So, yeah, and um, yeah, that's basically my experience. And I think it should bullying in schools should be stopped as soon as possible. But and online bullying as well. I've had online bullying, of course. Who hasn't? Like. But, um, yeah, so, you know, I'm, I want to try and stop, you know, raise awareness because, as most of you probably have heard, um, 
like a couple of years ago, Amanda Todd took her life because she was getting getting death threats and people were telling her to drink bleach, etc., etc. It was horrible. And she actually committed suicide. It's so sad. And it actually worked as she died. And that, and still people are bullying her, saying that she deserved it and all this. I was just like, well, how do you know what was going on behind closed doors? Like, yeah, she sent a nude to her, you know, she sent a nude picture of her breast to a guy she she thought she could trust. That's not anything wrong with that. Millions of girls do it every single day. You know what I mean? To their boyfriends and to people they hardly know. So it's like, well... Why does she get a single treatment? Like, it's horrible. But, yeah, all you've got to do really is just, like, remember not to bully people. Uh, just to, like, appreciate everyone for their differences, really. Like, I've learned now that, well, I mean, I never really used to bully anyone. But saying horrible things to friends and family isn't really helping yourself either like i don't know it's just just one of them things i suppose but i'm getting there <laughs> so it'll be all right in the end i spent anyway here's my little lad i'm gonna be two on friday thank you my baby and then I got this little one. She pretty. Her name's Cassie. Come on, Cass. <laughs> Come on. This is Barney. <gasps> Who's that Barney? <laughs> yeah, so that's the end of my vlog for today. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Thumbs up if you like this video and comment down below if you have any comments about this particular video or if you want to share your experiences or if you just want to message me. If you want to message me, I can give you my Facebook or whatever so you can share your experiences with me. But uh, yeah, so I will speak to you again soon. Bye, guys.